now I feel a little deflated here. I haven't won. My confidence is down. I'm bowling terribly today. All right, we need to we need to redo this. We need to go to the pro room. All right, Phil Rock. That's a cool name, man. What's your name, Phil Rock? That is so cool. I wish my name was Phil Rock. All right, I like that he's got a Roto Grip logo inside of his Facebook um, account. Uh, what pattern are we bowling on here? Uh, Stonehenge. All right. Oh, he's got a fight. Old school fight. I, I didn't mind that ball. I didn't have a lot of success with it, but when I did bowl with it, and when I did like it, I liked it. All right, so I'm going to use the Marble Pearl this time. I like what I'm seeing here. I think this ball is going to have a little bit of length. Stonehenge is a little bit uh, shorter oil pattern that we are just on. And that's a pretty good shape right there with my Marble Pearl. So... Now the Marvel Pearl looks a little better. The pattern's a little bit shorter. It's going to create a little bit more friction for me. And as you can see, the ball, you know, mixed them up pretty good. Anthony Pepe has joined the chat. Anthony Pepe, one of the best left-handed bowlers we have on tour. G'day, Anthony. Uh, I hope you're playing. We have the left-handed option in the game, Mr. Pepe. So, you know, don't be afraid to get online and you know, challenge me. I would like to play against a lefty today. And my run hasn't been so good. I've lost every match. So if you're going to win, today could be a good time for that to happen. Phil Rock, though, has hit a rock. <laughs> it's a terrible joke. Um, oh, my Marvel Pearl looks good. I'm getting some carry. Tripping out the nine pin. All right, let's answer a couple of questions here. Uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, Ricky Estes says, uh, Belmo, no excuses on your game, laugh out loud. Yeah, you're right. I shouldn't be complaining, I shouldn't be whinging, and I shouldn't be creating excuses. I shouldn't, but I'm going to. Uh, you see, I started the first match, and I didn't have my Arsenal fit, okay? So I'm just going to pretend that match never happened, and it was on Red Square. So that's the difficult, most difficult oil pattern. I didn't have a bloody spare ball and I wasn't really prepared. I just kind of happened. I didn't want to quit and Reggie smashed me. Ball in 111 and Reggie smashed me. And then the next match, you know, I, I used the wrong ball. Okay, I tried to use the Marvel Pearl. The pattern was too long. I used it for like one or two shots in practice and I thought I, I did it. No, that was a bad idea. Now... I've loosened up a little bit. I've had a couple of warm-up games. I've got the right ball and the right pattern. Now there's no excuses. Okay, now, now I'm going to, to win. Oh, that's a little left. All right, we'll take a Brooklyn 9-pin. I'm going to want that ball. I want that ball. Well, it's so much easier to spare on the easier patterns. You just kind of... Fling it out there, the ball holds, the ball hooks. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, my foot! I forgot to answer that question. Damien Richards asked again, how's your foot going? And wow, so many trophies you have there. Um, yeah, these trophies are, are all of my, there's a, there's a whole cabinet that goes that way a little bit too. I'm very, very proud of um, the things that I've been fortunate to win. Um, and everything that is of any value to me in bowling uh, is on that, on that, in that trophy cabinet. Um, you can see my Player of the Year trophies down there. What else is on there? We've got a timeless ball that I won with um, at the Players' Championship. What else can you see in the video? My Tournament of Champions trophy. Uh, i got some bobbleheads that I made. Oh, my very first trophy, which is, um, how am I going to do this? It would be this way, and because there's a slight delay, I'm going to have to wait until... Oh, it's my turn. Hold on. You guys are trying to get me to lose here. Go Brooklyn again. Oh, five count. Come on. Hook a little bit. Spare ball? No. Okay, so where was I? Uh, that one. That's the bowling foundation. Um, Long Island Open, that's my very first tour title trophy. 
So that's up there too. Um, yeah, so I'm going to try and do this again. There's a bit of a delay. Oh no, you got it. It worked. I'm watching my delay as I'm talking to you to make sure it's all working still. So anyway, we've got SP trophies back there. Yeah. Uh, okay, so my foot. Let's talk about my foot while Phil Rock um, is struggling. Um, so yesterday, uh, I, I said earlier that it wasn't my father's fault and it wasn't, it was my fault. Um, we had a, a pretty big trailer filled with uh, all sorts of stuff and it was back in out of a, out of a garage and the way that the, um, the trailer was turning, I thought it was going to hit one of these little glass panels that we kind of set up um, near the garage. So I went to move the glass panel and I, I did that, but I didn't think dad was still driving the trailer backwards as I was doing that. So the trailer continued to move backwards while I was moving the glass panel and then it just ran uh, straight over my foot. Now I'm very lucky because um, I don't think it broke anything. I don't think so. I would know. I would know if it broke something. And I'm not going to show you. No, there's someone who just wrote in the chat. Can I see your foot? No. <laughs> no, you can't see my foot. So there's no break. Uh, it's a bit of bruising. It's a little sore, but I can walk quite normally. I'm going to have a practice tonight at the lanes to make sure that I'm bowling and there's no pain while I bowl. Dad felt pretty bad um, for like a minute. And then he realized that I was the idiot. And then he blamed me, which is fair enough. So the trailer over my foot, it hurt, but there was some good that came of it. Okay. So you can imagine while I'm, well, that was a really bad shot. While I'm, um, while a trailer is going over my foot, there would be a reason, right? Why there is a trailer filled with stuff. Well, I was supposed to help move all of that trailer stuff to another location and it would, would require a lot of work and then I ran over my foot and then I got the afternoon off. No more work for me. So, you know, there's a silver lining to everything. All right, Phil. Phil is uh, he's persistent with his fight. I like it. He's got that ball hooking a lot, but he's starting to make his spares. And I haven't concentrated at all, so it's time for me to get back into it. Solid nine. I mean, that was close. That was a better shot. Get my pitchy. All right. Spare. So we're coming down to the last three frames. Uh, Mr. Rock needs to... He needs to start striking, or he needs to hope that I start opening. It's probably more likely that I'm going to open than he is to uh, to strike, <laughs> the way that I've been bowling today. But I would like a win on the board, Phil. So don't don't strike out. Don't. I just want to feel the confidence of winning. As we wait for Phil, oh, Phil, no Phil. No, Phil. Strike for Phil. Finally. Oh, that messenger was supposed to hit it, and it didn't. Let's go across here. Oh, Jason, no. No. No, the pressure is getting to me. Phil, don't talk to me while I'm playing the game. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Are you kidding me? Cannot spare under the pump. I feel good for you. I'm very glad that you left. Oh, he, that was a great shot too. He got robbed. That's really unlucky. Really unlucky. You really deserved uh, a better shot at, at that seven pin. That seven pin deserved the fall. Maybe you get one. Okay, so let's see. All right, so if he strikes out, it'll force me to mark, which is no gimme. Let me see it, Phil. Let me see it. Let me see. I'll say, come on, you can do it. Oh, he didn't do it. 
Did he get robbed again? Yeah, he kind of got unlucky again. That was like a Brooklyn nine pin. That, that should fall as well. That's unlucky. Sorry, Phil, but you have become my first victim. Thanks, Phil. It was a good game. I'll make the spare. Not with that ball, I won't. Maybe I won't make the spare. Didn't matter. Didn't need the spare. 151 and victory. Victory is mine. Leave. 